Hey folks, that's Price is Wrong with uh, Battle Vortex, and uh, <clears throat> I'm getting replaced in Battle Pirates. Sorry, <clears throat> all my Twitch stuff got away from me. <laughs> it sure did. It all got away from me. Alright. Well, anyway, I kind of just took a peek out at the world map real quick, and I noticed that I have a, uh, a lot of stuff out here to open. So, uh, I guess I'm going to do that. Let's see here. I got, well, there's a lot of stuff out there that's open that needs picking up, so I'm going to get out there and just pick some of the stuff up. Let's see if I can find... There we go. Three fleets out here. Not out of work. I need to get out here and rank some boats, man. I do, I do. I just cleaned this all up. Hey, Vato, what's going on, man? I just cleaned this all up just a little bit ago, too. Thought I was going to get on here and get an early start. And... Let's see if I clean some of this up, get it re respawn real quick so I can put a crew on and get out of here. I actually don't even have any crews right now. I'm actually running low on uranium again. I've been spending my uranium like crazy. Hey, White Star, what's going on, buddy? Phantom Menace. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, let's see. I almost forgot about the hangout. Alright. So I'm on the hangout. Really don't need any of this res. I just want to get the stuff cleaned up so I can get out here and rank. I mean, I'm not full or anything, but, you know. White Star, what's going on, buddy? I got room for the res. Believe me, I got tons of room. Hello. Hey, what's going on? Hi, yo. Hello. <clears throat> See, I don't get to listen to the music when you're on the hangout, but... <laughs> I'm not sure how much you're really missing right now. 
This is a Halloween music, believe it or not. I didn't even know there was such a thing. Oh, right, okay. Jonas, try to get these res cleaned up so I can get out here and rank. I actually, uh, I mean, I, I, I could work on Forsaken Mission some more, but it just that uh, I can't, I can't make myself go through the trouble of getting that 65 million, man. I just, it's too much. Uh, have you done the first one? Yeah, yeah, right. the first one's done. Yeah. Sweet. What did he get? The uh, the blister. Did I blister? No. Uh, yeah. I decided to um, go quickly last night and to uh, go for work in the morning. Say again? Sorry, I had to go quickly last night after the show. It's um, I had to go straight to bed. I work early in the morning, so... Oh, uh, don't apologize for making a living, man. It's all good. So I mean, you gotta gotta pay kick size somehow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Next week should be better because it's mind you, it's going to be a uh, round table next week as it's a raid. Uh, well, yeah, I guess we'll we'll see. I know we generally don't do them during the raid. We did last month, but um, uh, it, I mean, if the demand is strong enough for one, obviously we'll do one. You know, um, so that's basically what it boils down to uh, is if we, if the demand is strong enough and we have somebody to cover it, which. Uh, you know, I'm not the only one now that uh, is doing them. Um, so now we've got uh, Vlad, and I think White Star may even be interested in doing them too here in the future. Uh -huh. Yeah, be interested to see um, people's opinion on how different it was the last raid to this one. Mm, yeah. How much difficulty has gone down, if at all. I think that'll come out on Thursday's show as well, because the riddle have started before the Thursday show will actually air. I uh, just caught up to the guy that's out here popping them. Yeah, well for the uh, US players, but it won't for the UK players, but it's a uh, different time. Yeah, what I'm trying to say there, Phantom, is the rage has generally started before the, sh the Thursday show goes live. Alright, <clears throat> let me see what I can do to get me a crew. Oh, you're rolling. Alright, um, I don't think that I currently have any. Uh, salty dogs. Nope, don't have any. Alright, got a good sea serpents for the free crew, that's good, I'll take that. Uh, I've only got uh, about less than 23,000 uranium, so hopefully I don't have to do this too much. Ouch. You, you are getting low. What have you been spending on? Oh, there's, a, there's one. Um, uh, mainly... Uh, Mainly retrofit, or I'm sorry, yeah, mainly retrofits. My retrofit lab's been keeping, I've been keeping it busy. Right now, I'm doing uh, countermeasure weapons, which are 48,000 uh, pop once you pass rank 10. So I'm trying to get those done up to R15. Oh, uh, okay. And I, and I, um, I, I did my shipyard three. My dock 13 is done. My shipyard three is done as well. So, and currently, I've got um, um, on my outpost. I've got, um, I got it. Well, that didn't take any uranium, though, so. Mm 
Yeah, I'll just start doing my way out of this. Uh, 9,000, just over 9,000 a pop uranium wise, so. Which is only two, uh, two drap bases, so not too bad. Man, I like all the missiles flying off of there, man. It's awesome. Love it. Love it. I don't know if you guys uh, are aware, but uh, once I got my shipyard done and my dock done, um, there was tons of room for... Um, there was tons of room again for... Um, hey, Roger Nader. There's Dirty Harry. Yeah, I'm twitching, man. Twitching. I, uh... What was I saying? Oh, I had lots of uh, extra weight on my uh, Rhino fleet, right? Which I expected, and I managed to uh, just go ahead and put a crap ton more blades on there. So I'm up to 40 blades in this fleet. Wow. Overkill or what? <laughs> well, you might need it for the Scourge, right? The overkill. True enough. True. We got three, so you got... We only got four, didn't you? Say again? I got three rhinos. rhinos? Yeah, there's three, three rhinos. rhinos. Three rhinos, yeah. Three they'll have someone. Yeah, my Frosty's got like four on there. So you got 12 on each. Semantis on each one. Yep, yep. Got uh, on each Rhino, I've got uh, uh, two Phalanx 3s. And I've got a Phalanx 3 on the um, Frosty as well. Mm -hmm. And I think I, I had to put some torpedoes uh, with the speed buffs on there to get my speed up high enough on my Frosty to keep up with my Rhinos. Yep. Yeah, there's a flash fleet of rhinos. Right. Yeah, I had to slow mine down. Sorry, mate. I had to slow mine down because uh, before I did um, Species and Five, I had to slow the rhinos down by putting heavy plating on them. <laughs> That's not a bad thing, I suppose. Having heavy plating on them. Yeah, but now. Now I've got loads of space with the shipyard three and space system five. I can now take them off and put in compound armor on it and uh, make them all fast again. Now, so I've got more refits to do to last me till next Christmas, I think. We all have a shipyard three. I think I could do with about five dry docks and about one. Yeah, these things are great, man. Forty blaze missile or blade missiles, man. That's pretty awesome. <laughs> yeah, I had forty blades on my V two H fleet at one point, but I just took some off to put some antis on it. I'm gonna do a do an eighty five um, stronghold now for three coins, so which is pretty good. Holy dog. I need to Jeez. remember to jump out of these things early so I can see how many I can get. Oops, I'm sitting there guarding. <laughs> I'm going to guard this cargo. Let's attack that elite. Man, what the heck's going on here? Let's attack that elite. You stay in there for the raid then, yeah. uh, Price? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is the spot. It's actually falling right this time. I've actually got two whole days of the weekend for this raid this time, and I'm gonna get one. Oh, sweet. I've got 15 hours a day, so. Ouch. Um, yeah, coach driver, mate, that's what the problem is. Ah. Uh. 
it's not all working all the time. It's um, half it's dead time, but I'm not at home. That's the problem. I oh, drive four and a half hours and have a forty-five minute break. Uh, I drive three hours and have a seven-hour break. <laughs> 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 yeah, we do do the commute up in the morning to London, then uh, we had to go and park up for about seven or eight hours and start the evening run. Uh, not, not not worth going back back to the yard. So, uh, well, sometimes we can. I might during the raid sometimes to get some playing time in, but. I don't normally. Gotta give it a chance. Butter, bacon, eggs. You gotta give it a chance. Oh, I hate butter, bacon, eggs. Hey, Sparks. Man, one volley took out that dread, man. That's awesome. Huh. Somebody's picking up your uh, cargoes, uh, uh, so that's good. Yeah, yeah, I'll keep them picking it up. Nice when they respawn straight away. You can go back on yourself and. Oh, that's, it again. that's the guy I was just cleaning up after so that I could uh, get out here and rank. I was just cleaning them up after him so I could rank. Because he was out here, had everything open around the uh, the ring here, and I uh, had pulled out a whole bunch of fleets to come out here and pick it up. Hmm. So, what do you think of the prizes will be this way then, Price? I'm not gonna lie, man. That freaking uh, new that super that mega hull, man. I, I it's kind of scary. It sounds scary. Yep. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not too worried about that one. I don't think I'll be doing many uh, of the vanguards, but I'm just wondering, wondering about what the normal prices are going to be. Whether they're going to repeat the last raid prices or not? Like the Harlock Ages and the uh, all the rest of them. Yeah, this new uh, sub that's coming out that's going to be the main prize. Um, obviously, you know, I, I know we don't know everything about it right now but I uh, I know we know a lot about it and uh, I don't know it seems like it's something that uh, could be potentially worthwhile but I don't know if it's a game changer you know what I mean uh, I mean it, it I, I liked how uh, GD Riken you know when he was on the show last Thursday he said um, he said that it's supposed to help with the uh, Drac Armadas and and Scourge going forward that was basically what it was designed for which I personally, I really appreciate that. You know what I mean? That kind of input. I think, sorry, one price. No, I'm done. That was it. No, I think that's a that's a good thing as well. If it's not a game changer, it means we can have a bit of a rest. If it's not a game changer and you don't want to build it, then you can carry on building your fleets that you need to. Rogenator, if this raid is a pain in the butt, bud, I uh, and I, I mean, I've been like really busting my hump and spending some coin and a lot of time on here trying to make sure that it's not a pain in my butt. You know what I mean? And uh, so hopefully it's not that demoralizing. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I don't, you know, hopefully. Well, I think after the last raid and the the feedback they got from the last raid, I don't think they dare do it again. Personally, well, it is kicks, so you never know. We will just have to wait and see till this Thursday. Yeah, but when they're saying they're, they're trying to make things better, listen to the community, all that lot, I don't think they'll dare go backwards on and uh, make it as hard as it was last time or, or harder, like they normally do. At least they put the co op in this time. Yeah. <clears throat>
Uh, I hope to, hopefully they don't show us a video again how to play. <laughs> yeah, it <laughs> killed me. I was going to say something, but I thought I better not know. <laughs> this is how you move for your ships. Yeah. You've got to do number one twice, though, to you. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, it better not be like that. This this fleet right here ought to kick some major butt, man. That's all I got to say. It ought to just really smoke them. I wish there was some Scourge I could test on like right now. It'd be really awesome. Did you do all five of the um, Proto Hunter? Yeah, I um, did. Yeah, yeah, I did. Well, it's still not around now, is it? So, no point in saying that. <clears throat> Silly me. Alright, now I'm going to have to start traveling a little bit, it looks like, to start finding stuff to hit. I suppose you could test it on the Kraken. The Kraken campaign. Ah, uh, that's true. I guess I could go in there and... That could be interesting. If I did win that big, if I did win that, that big super mega hole sub that they're coming out with, that'd be yeah, nice. Go ahead and go crack it, go, go up against the Kraken with that thing. It deep dives, I deep dive, that kind of thing. That'd be awesome. Yeah. You both deep dive and crash into each other. <laughs> if only you could crash. That's one of the things they said. That originally, that was the original intent with Battle Pirates, was that um, you could, uh, that, you know, you weren't supposed to be able to, like, stack boats originally. That's just that's oh. something that everybody got used to. And so they just didn't fix it. <laughs> and uh, but that was part of their original plan was to make it you know how like Vega Conflict um, I don't know if you're familiar with that game but you can't stack ships on that in that game and um, that was they intended to do that with Battle Pirates but um, everybody got really accustomed to uh, being able to stack ships and all that that they uh, don't do that anymore or they never fix that I was going to say that would be awful with your ships in base defense, wouldn't it, if they couldn't stack, because normally you get a couple stacking. Yeah, obviously the stacking has changed, uh, you know, it's had an impact on the game, so. Mm. Strategies and everything else. So just saying that when you said uh, crashing into each other, you know, once upon a time, you know, that was their original intent, was to make it so that you could crash into it. Well, could crash, but... And sink. Yeah, I don't know if you would have sunk or anything like that. I know in um, Vega Conflict, the ships just kind of bump up against each other. They don't actually take damage. Ah. Uh, be quite funny to bump into another ship and have a big hole in the hull and sink. <laughs> yeah. Oops. There's some more stuff spawned up there. Maybe I'll just go up here real quick. Kind of feel like maybe I ought to put one of them map speed things in my fleet here so I could fly across the map a little quicker. <laughs> Price, th yeah. Hi, hi, hi Michael. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a couple of 71s near my base as well, uh, guys. I just saw like a little nest of uh, big stuff up here to hit, so I went ahead and uh, just drove up here real quick. I love how fast some things die, man. That is awesome. Yeah, I do. I suppose kick so I even didn't think about limited ammo for ships either, did I? Yeah, I don't know if that was ever part of the ever an intent intended part of the game, but that one But I did I did find it was interesting about the whole ship stacking thing though. I did find that was interesting. Mm. 
that won't be good nowadays when you're ranking would it you, every five or ten minutes you have to go back to your base yeah yeah, yeah but Three. <laughs> I suppose I shouldn't have said that, but kicks off. I would do that now and, and charge you about 20 hours for re refitting all your weapons and your ships. Oh, don't give them ideas, please. No. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, quite honestly, there'd have to be some really good weapons to get people to uh, switch yeah. over to something like that. I can't wait for this base attack thing to come out. Oh, the best campaign. Yeah. That sounds interesting. Well, I, I, I sent a message before I said about um, have they thought about if someone's guarding your base outside, if someone's on guard outside, can you start a campaign or not? That's a thing you should be able to. Well, yeah, yeah I would think so. Different code, wouldn't they? Because normally you, get, you hit the fleet outside, don't you? If you. Oh, they may have already worked all that out. I mean, you know. Uh... I don't, I don't know if that's really giving them too much credit, but I'm just saying that it, it's possible that they may have already figured all that out in the test server. I hope so, anyway, that we're not having to figure all that out. What you tried to say there, guys. <laughs> yeah. Everyone all comes right. to do the base attack and then find to uh, they get a crash or... Um, the, does the Hellstar have drones? Uh, Mm, and it, it, it does have uh, they're not they're, they are drones but they're technically scouts I think they call them something different other than drones because it spits out two at a time and it's only got a six max it's only got room for six so uh, and two at a time and I know there's a crew that you can put on there to up that to four I think at a time if I'm not mistaken Yes, yeah, so is a legendary one? Yeah. I got rid of all mine. Oh man, not enough retargeted there. Oh well. What rank you up to now, boss? Um. Well, I'll find out in a few after I finish with my crew. Yeah. And I'll, I'll figure out. I mean, right now, I, I know I've got some 40s. i got some crews up here in the... A couple of these ships are in the 40s, but uh, some of them are still in the 30s, I think. So I'm trying to get them up to the 50s or 60s, hopefully here soon. Yeah, you're not done bad, but you haven't had them that long, have you, really? I'm kind of hoping I'll be able to rank up even quicker now with the, all these other weapons, but you I mean I'm seeing I'm killing the targets quicker? Yeah, oh, yeah. It could be. I think my rhinos now are up to. Dang. Is it 57, 59, something like that? And mine yeah. is 66 and 68, yeah. I think, on mine too. There's so many little bases here. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I know. It's bad for ranking in sector, in our sector at the moment. I went to Sector 90 this afternoon and hit their 71s. Is that a good one there? Can I take it? Uh, let me have a look. I just peeked and I think it was all open. Uh, bear with me a minute. Hey, Deathstalker. Yeah, there's. They're all opened. Yeah, I'm having to run all over the place here. There's a couple, but it's not worth going. Now, even the band bases will will spawn uh, cargoes, so as long as they're high enough level. Tell you what I do to find uh, decent areas. I click on leaderboards and look at the. Uh, player medals and it's the first top three pages I go look around their bases and I generally find they're in big alliances so there's plenty of 71s around them. It's like that Blaze Wow guy's coming back up. I don't know I just assumed that there would be more I didn't think it'd be a bigger problem for me coming in here and both of us ranking at the same time but it is. 
Mm. And just try to hit everything. So not worrying about whether it's big or not. Shame you don't get enough um, XP off of drop bases and stuff like that, really. Got 30 minutes on this crew, man. So that's the problem, isn't it? Now uh, the time on it. Yeah. Yeah, 50 minutes is a good amount of time, but I don't know. It'd be nice if those triple salty dogs came out more often. <laughs> oh, that's nice. 300 percent. Yeah. What well, sex you in butter, bacon, eggs? Oh, that open there, so. Oh, yeah. I've learned that one. Transfer rank to other holes. I swear I'd saw one somewhere out here. <coughs> How long have you got left, uh, Price? Like 30 minutes or 28 minutes, something like that. Okay. I'm trying to see if there's like a, a high section around here somewhere. I see that Blaze Wow guy is going further, further west. <coughs> so I probably shouldn't follow him. I'd look on you, um, non sector targets and see what go on there for high level basing. Go up there. That's what we do. Transferring rank to other holes. I I have not heard of anything like that, Death Stalker. No, I've heard a couple of rumors about that, but I've heard no from Kicksai, so I think it'd really be cool if you could like transfer rank to uh, like a uh, the limited counterpart of a particular hole. You know, that'd be awesome. Mm. I found a decent sector for you guys if you want to... I appreciate it, Dirty Harry. Thank you. Yeah, yeah, if there's tons of it there, I mean, and I do mean tons, because if I go there, I'm probably not going to have anybody clean up, clean up after me. Then I... you'll post, post it in chat. Awesome. And if you look down south, there's loads as well. From uh, That should tie you 30 minutes up. Sorry, 30 minutes up anyway. Yeah, if I go over there, I'm not going to have uh, Dirty Hair clean them up after me trying to help me with the response, but... It's just off center tower as well, so you're not that far away from tower. I think Dirty Harry should change his name. Shadow? I think Dirty Harry should change his name. I <laughs> what too? Twice his shadow. <laughs> <laughs> yes, ma'am. Alright. Dirty Harry's out there picking up too. 
Babe, he's already been out there picking up. Ouch. <laughs> <laughs> It's good job I'm not in the same world as you. I think you'll be coming to attack me by now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, guy can fight in a base, man. Oh, I don't doubt it. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if Dirty Harry needs it or not either. No lights? Oh, <laughs> it is a shadow joke, I get it. I love how fast these things kill a fleet, man. Yeah, they're awesome, aren't they? Mm. He's killed, dumping it. <laughs> Yeah, Dirty Harry says he's actually cubed. Everything he's picking up, he's dumping. All good then. I've got 42 on my fleet blades. Trying to keep it moving just in case. Yeah, I actually I'm in one of the bookmarks, the one that White Star posted, uh, Dirty Harry, is where I'm at now. So I'm not I'm not in, in sector anymore. I'm outside somewhere else killing cargos, trying to find a bunch of big ones. Oh, look at that. Oh, Rhino Ranking. <laughs> They're probably not going to be legendary before Thursday. I'll say that much. Oh, and mine won't be as well. No, mine. Unless we coin the rank, but I'm not going to do that. No, not 80 odd a rank now. 85, I think it is, isn't it? Yeah, it used to be 72, but it's 85 now. It's not worth it anymore, because a couple of months' time will. Have different fleets. In fact, I think I've only, I've only got two fleets that are fully ranked: my Night Hawk, my Hawks, and my Berserkers. I got my uh, Harlock Atlas carriers legendary, and then I quit using them. <laughs> 
Oh no! I need to refit them, get some locusts on there to make them useful, but... Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Price, looking, looking near the uh, sector chat. Oh no. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh He's... no. <laughs> he jumped. <clears throat> Who jumped? I did. Phantom Menace, looking sector chat. Oh, is that him? Oh, Phantom Menace, yeah, I see him. Yeah. Not only to uh, help you guys, I've got a target I want to hit as well. Have you? So, yep. <clears throat> it says sweet quads. <laughs> Typical <laughs> Harry. <laughs> well, ha tell Harry to look outside his front door. I'm right below him. No, Kawaza, who are you going to hit? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let me just look on my battle log. If you got your battle log working right. Oh. <laughs> don't, don't, don't even go there. <laughs> Yeah. I got guys out here trying to ninja me in this sector. You went to it's a it's subs. It's a level twenty five. It's not going to kill you. He probably just wants my cords. Probably. <clears throat> Not no bubble either. Ah, ah, ah. Sorry? My target's not no bubble either. We will have in a minute. Are you gonna go hit him? Yep. Okay. Yeah, he probably just wants my cords. <laughs> nice one, Harry. <laughs> well, how you picked him up? No, excellent. In what is real, excellent. I don't have to drive far to get my newest fan. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Go for it, Harry. Give me a test. Go on. When I was with MBK, man, uh, when I, I first got my proto, I had people like out there actually uh, attacking all of MBK just to make sure they could. Uh, nobody was trying to protect my proto, so they could ninja it. I mean, it's crazy. Yeah, it's amazing what people do to get kicks nowadays. Yeah. Did you post the coordinates in Com's Phantom? What the one on the hit? Yeah. Uh, no, not yet. There you go. Uh -huh. The level 82 one? Yep. Firefly. Never heard of him. He's worth uh, zero to me. Yeah, he's worth zero to me. He's only got about 100, 100 medals. Huh. It's an old nemesis of mine when I was growing up, so... Yeah, it's good. Lots of good cargo out here, man, for sure. I'm, like, uh, found yeah. a nice little sweet spot. <laughs> Book market uh, price. Oh, yeah, I did. Good.
You still got that fleet of subs chasing you around. No, I don't see it anymore, but I'm still staying hot, man, knowing that they were already out looking for me. I'm uh, going to see keep coming out hot. <coughs> Harry says he's sitting by his base now. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> this is not a fleet you want to hit with subs for sure. No. Well, you got a frosty in there, aren't you? So that'll detect him anyway. Yeah, this fleet's going to be awesome. Better be awesome, darn it. If it's not awesome, I quit. <laughs> well, again? Uh-huh. Again? Yeah, again, yeah. <laughs> Need to get Price a new t-shirt. I quit. <laughs> Is that... How much your fleet can just hold is three rhinos. You can't add another one or something. Oh no, I'm 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 at I'm at weight. Uh, okay. I'm, yeah, I'm at weight. Yeah, I had uh, I when I built this fleet, I designed it. I designed it with room to grow, uh, ah. so that I, it had um, you know when I, I got shipyard three and dock thirteen, mm -hmm. you know that I could just throw some more missiles on there. Sweet. Yeah. Yeah, it worked out, man. I'm glad I did. I mean, because I packed this thing out. Hmm. Nick, I've got tons of armor on them, too, man. So, I mean, it's... Have you? I thought you didn't put no bulk in it. I thought you went with Evade. Uh, I did go with Evade. Ah, but okay. I'm just saying it's still, like, over 20,000. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I forgot to come out hot on that one. Darn it. Oh, good. Good, good. Ah, I see phantoms ready to hit. <laughs> Although it hasn't lit up red yet, but I'm lagging really badly. No, it was, did lag on mine as well, it's just gone red. Oh. So she's got a guardian, it is. Nope. Yes, yes. It's not special, though. Oh no, absolutely not. I just oh, like flattening it. I no just like it. flattening it. No air props, no Wendy. That's Harry's latest farm, is that? <laughs> He's welcome to it. I actually do got some missile crews, and uh, I think I've I've got I know I've got at least one sea serpent crew anyway, but it's not the good one. It's well, I mean I guess they're all good, but I'm mean, it's not the the, the the big big one. Twenty five percent of it. Yeah. And you know this fleet, my rhinos have already are already over eighty percent evade. Yeah, sweet is that. No doubt you'll have a good. Uh... Missile defense. I think the only thing you're going to be lacking for the scourge is uh, concussive defense. Yeah. Well, my frosty's got some concussive, but yeah, I wish I had some Aegis, but you know. I know. I I got Harry. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. I do plan on trying to help my wife out as much as I can on this event too, being that they're putting co-op back in. 
Sweet. Mm, good job, Phantom. That's uh, not bad for little blue shite's feet, is it? No. You need more blood missiles on it, though. 36. Why the R10? If at any uh, time. No, I'll be Harry, if, if any time I found it sounds like I'm taking you for granted, I'm not. I do appreciate it. Sorry, the, the help you've given me. I meant your uh, VHs. VHs are nine. Nine, nine. Okay. Just going to R10 in yeah. three, three and a bit days. Sweet. Just before the raid. <laughs> Rename Price Price's Harry's Shadow. <laughs> <laughs> or that. Nice one, Butter Bakers. Yeah. I like that one. Yeah, I like that one too. love getting all of the missiles up in the air, man. It is awesome. Can't be a long left on your crew now. Yeah, I got about six minutes. Oh, you think your set is our set is dead? This one's actually awful. <laughs> hey, take care, Roginator. How's it going? <laughs> set to ninety nine has got well nothing in it, really. <laughs> There's so many low down salves, it's unbelievable. I bet you got a lot of missiles out of there. That was pretty sweet.
Thing just chew stuff up. It's nice. Yeah, it's nice fleet of rhinos. <clears throat> Three minutes left on my crew. The hunters are good as well. Yeah, I actually got my first one in the oven right now. My first oh, hunter. Sweet. What are you putting on it? Uh, starting off with and... yeah, just starting off at six blade missiles and speed system. Okay. I'm going to get me a couple holes, a few holes built that way, so I'm getting can get them ranking. I guess I probably ought to put a guidance missile system on there too. I didn't think about that, but oh well. I just put that on there later. I'll put that on before I start. Hmm. See, then what you can do is once you get it, the hunter ranked up nicely enough, then you can remove a rhino and replace it with a hunter. Or maybe you may maybe remove my frosty or something. Oh, I won't say remove your frosty because your frosty takes sub. So does a hunter. So does a hunter. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, but the hunter doesn't have a slow down field like the frosty does. Yeah, it's true. Got less than a minute left in here. It's about twenty six seconds, man. It's awesome. <laughs> you might get another one. Yep. Yeah, it's expired. That's all right. I'll go ahead and kill this other one. I probably should no. just keep going. <laughs> <laughs> if it lasts, yeah. <laughs> well, I can't. Yeah, well, I can keep going, but the crew's obviously you're not going to give me double VXP anymore. No, I don't mean that. The amount of times you clicked on that level seventy-one cargo, then to engage it. Oh yeah, yeah. It took a few clicks before it let me mm. in. I, if he is, I don't know. He's actually not on the Hangout right now. He's on the Twitch chat. Uh, Dirty Harry is, but... I'm not quite sure what he's uh, doing at the moment.
Flying Welshman, how's it going? Clean up this area right here, and then I'll be out of here. Yeah, I think she was just asking about cargo. Uh, I think she was looking to pick some cargo up for somebody. I don't know if she needs it though. I, don't, she, I think she's just trying to be helpful. I'm doing all right. Uh, I'm doing okay there, Flying Welshman. Doing all right, man. It's Sunday. It kind of feels like a Sunday, which is good. Mm. Feel, it's not bad. Trouble is Sunday. Monday's work. Yeah. Try not to focus on that. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Have you checked your mail out yet, Price? Oh, that's... Oh, invite me to your alliance. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely enjoying being this, doing solo for a bit. I, I fully expected you to fly it. I just, uh, I just thought I'd send it anyway. Yeah. Uh, I know Sparks over there next to me. He started his. Uh, he's he, he when he arrived, he was uh, K A S, mm -hmm. and he dropped tagged and asked if I wanted to start a group and um, and uh, of course I, I I didn't. So he uh, he he started one. He started see, his own there. I see we've got a P N L S near us. Oh yeah, yeah, that's the chosen one. He's actually retired. Huh. Uh, you guys might remember him. I don't know if any of you guys ever watched the crib show, but uh, he had done some of those. He was the guy with all the shoes behind him. I've heard the name. I haven't seen him. Yeah. But I've TCO, Chosen One, yeah. I've heard of the name as well. Yeah, Scott Hardy is his name on Facebook. He's, he's cool. He was on here on the chat last night on Twitch. He gets on here from time to time. He wasn't very happy when I spent some coin on here on these rhinos. Was not happy with me. But. <laughs> well, you could say that was Harry's fault. Yeah, I'm like, <laughs> I, I was just like, you know, I've actually already spent the money. The money's gone. I don't get that back. So it's like now it's just about what I do with it. You know what I mean? Exactly. Well, the rhinos are good to actually multi-fleet. You can do a lot of things with a rhino. Yeah, yeah, it's just really strong, man. I mean, I, I think me personally, I think it's great for scourge. I mean, sorry. Go on, yeah, on. I, I think the hunters, the prototype hunters, would be better, but you know, so, so it's also good for doing missions as well as the rhino. Yeah, I could do a lot with these for sure. <laughs> Spark is on the now. <laughs> oh, there's he. Sparks is in the chat. He's yeah. he just said he was in chaos two days ago. Yeah. T D O S F. Yes, it's all, it was a joke. <clears throat> Go and explain it then. <laughs> no, it's all right. It's, uh, 
<laughs> he doesn't need explaining. I want these things ranked, man. <laughs> Maybe I ought to go ahead and just take them back and uh, get another crew, come back. Yeah, it's pretty decent, that place, isn't it, for ranking? Have you got enough... You haven't got enough antis on it to um, auto it. Um, well, I, the only problem with the autoing is the mortars. Um, I don't have anything on here for mortars. Ah, okay. The only trouble when you're autoing is, well, it seems to be slower. Yeah, I always used to go go into engage battle, then click the uh, start, then come out and wait for it to finish, then yeah, do another you, one. If you've got a uh, a ranking crew on it's sometimes better off driving. Yeah. Hey, take care, Death Stalker. Have a good one. I think everybody's got fleets to rank before the scourge comes around. Yeah, I'm trying to get it all in, man. Oh. I'll use my uh, V2Hs, they're fully ranked up, so, and they've got the old uh, repair specialist on them. My wife wants to use her MCXs so bad, but it's like, you know, she, she they obviously they don't have thermal on them, so... No. What about using four with fro with a froster? Yeah, I think she's got. I think that's what she's doing actually. <coughs> Let's see how much you go. Oh yeah. Let's go out here real quick. Oh, it docked already. <laughs> how much did you get? Ah, four thousand two hundred twenty. That's not bad, that's pretty good, that. Especially from the one, uh, from the not so good one. Imagine if that were a 300% one. Yeah. That'd be awesome. Oh. oh, wow. You jumped up a few levels there. Yeah, I got a little bit, a little bit on there. It's nice. So this one's up to 48. I've got two of them at 48 now and uh, one at 37. My Frosty's now at 45. So 37 and then I'm in the 40s. So, but barely in the 40s. 48, man. That's good as that. Alright, let me go ahead and get me another crew here. I would really love a triple. <laughs> That's asking too much. See, stuff like that ticks me off. I know. 15 coins for that. That's unbelievable. Actually, that wolf pack, uh, I, I tried that before on my missile fleet, and I, I really was not impressed at all with it. I don't like it as well. It's only a 15% chance. There we go. No. <laughs> Look at the favoured ship as well. Sea wolves. Really? I'll go ahead and take that one. It's burning through that uranium, man. Burning through it. Might have to go hit some drag bases just to get some more uranium. <clears throat> oh, there we go. First shot. Of course, it wasn't a good one. But I'll take it.
<laughs> yeah, really, <Yeah>. Harry. <laughs> <laughs> He's got some legendary sea wolves, man, with blade missiles on them. The ones Harry has. Harry, yes, he does. <laughs> You're joking, I didn't he's know got, that. Yeah, he's got the guidance oh, wow. missile system on all that on there, on the sea wolves. <sighs> Daddy, bring him out, I've got to see it. <laughs> Don't kill none of my targets, so. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Daddy, I want to see him. I don't think so, but to make an eggs. <coughs> um, yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I think they might, but I'm not. I'm not sure. Um, there was somebody. Um, I think it was on the YouTube video. Um, uh, the the round table. There was a comment on there, and I thought somebody made a pretty good argument why the blueprint shouldn't have been in the Drac Armadas. And um, and the the reason that they they used was uh, the fact that people will be killing them just for a chance at a blueprint, and not for uranium. And uh, so they'll be mm -hmm. full and still hitting them, and so they won't be available for the other people who need uranium. So and that kind of made kind of made sense to me, I guess. Sure enough, but it is an opportunity missed to get them. Oh, that was you, butter bacon eggs. <laughs> that was a good point. It was a really good point. Ah, there he is. All right, go on then, Ari. Oh, I see D S O T F. That's your tag. <laughs> legendary rag, oh my god. Yeah, he's got legendary wolves, man, with blade missiles, man. Them things are no joke. But the blade missiles, I mean, with them being 300 and the fact that they don't have any armor points, means that you can make them still instant, instant repair. Nice. <laughs> wow. Yeah, almost made me want to go back and do my sea wolves, man. <laughs> I got mine in storage, though. I never, I didn't, scra I, I did scrap a couple. I'll, I'll admit, I got some that are scrap, but, but now you can get guidance missile system and everything else on there, man. They're, they could be pretty awesome. Mm. He said he's got R10 uh, battle cruisers to run with them as spotters. Awesome. <laughs> and things could probably chew up some scourge then, I bet. Yeah, the R10 BCs, they got a thermal range of 75, if I'm not mistaken. If memory serves it correct. Hmm. 
Yeah, I'm feeling that way too, Dirty Harry. I mean, I, I definitely feel like I've spent enough to where I should be able to crush this raid myself. And, uh, you know, it was so difficult for me last time. I didn't like that feeling, man. I, I hadn't felt that way since uh, I, my first Dreadnought, man. I ended up having to spend like 50 bucks on that particular raid and, and grind like freaking mad. Probably put in 40 hours just that weekend. <laughs> <laughs> At least I've got two uh, grease monkeys this time as well. Again, <clears throat> I think it'd be nice to have another rogue crew campaign this weekend. Can I ban the battle pirate sharks following me? Are, are you like still getting like notifications or something? Because I don't know how I can turn your notifications off. I don't. I don't know how I can do that. Yeah. Can't say much about you giving up the game, man. I can't say much about that at all. I'm there, buddy. Been there anyway. Holding out, though. Kind of committed to hold out a little longer. Well, guys, I'm off. I'm uh, work tomorrow morning, so... Alright, you have a good one. See you yeah. later, Phantom. Speak to you later. Yep. Have a good journey. <laughs> yeah, I'll try. Oh, from my... Oh, from... No, no, I, I don't... Mm. Let's see. I could always try and ban him. Um, yeah, give me a little bit. Oh, uh, uh, did you... What just happened? Did somebody just ban him? Yeah, that was me. Okay. Um, I don't, it, that might stop the the links going to him. He said there there was another account following me. Um, let me see. He said there was another Battle Pirates Sharks. I don't know. It does. The name does look the same. Yeah, that's what I thought. But, I don't know, it is taking up space in my ban list, so... I may accidentally unban it one day in the future. Yeah, that's what I was thinking too, I was thinking he may have banned the wrong account. Can you... Tell how many accounts you've got on your Twitch stream, though, Christ. I, I don't know. What, I don't understand the question. Can you tell how many people that are following you? Can you see who is following you? Oh, uh, the thing is, I got a crew on, and I'm busy ranking right now. That's why I wasn't going to ban him right now, or or investigate that. I was going to wait, but uh, and I'm not. I'm not going to do any of that right now because I got a crew on, and I'm ranking. All right, I'm gonna unban this guy here. All right, that guy's no longer banned.
Yeah. Yeah, I'm not going to look into all that at the moment. So I, um, I don't know if me banning somebody forces them, you know, de deletes their their um, deletes their uh, follow or not. I don't know. Yeah, it's mm -hmm. not this one. He said the name is very close, but yeah. You should actually just actually do it the right way, Battle Pirate Sharks, and just get your account sorted. Alright, you can do all of that, you know, you forgot your email and get the email and all that stuff, and then just do it the right way. I'd rather you did it the right way than have me doing a workaround. Not to mention, I mean, if you're not the real Battle Pirate Sharks and I banned the real guy, or the guy who didn't, doesn't actually want it, then, mm -hmm. uh, you know, I mean, because it is the internet, you know, and I don't really know you. I can't see your face. I, I don't know what the other guy's face looks like, even if I could see your face. So, I'd rather you, quite honestly, just, you took care of it on your own. And And not to mention, your name is Battle Pirate, and you don't play Battle Pirates? You made another account called Battle Pirate? What's up with that? So you got a few battle party accounts in, is what you're trying to tell me. Hmm. Yeah, I hate to say, man, I mean, this is like definitely first world problems here. And, you know, quite, quite honestly, man, I, I really feel like you should be handling that. I strongly feel that way. Okay, someone's in the lab going. Uh, yeah, it's my microwave. Wife is doing something. Oh, maybe it's oven timer or something. I don't know what she's doing in there. <laughs> well, <laughs> yeah, did you? <laughs> I think I heard you say that too. Yep. <laughs> so maybe my mic picks you up really good, babe, I guess. <laughs> nah, Harry says he'll be there soon. Yeah, come on over, Dirty Harry. You're welcome. No doubt Harry will want to be with it, though. <laughs> Bacon in a microwave. Hmm, no thank you. Is it bacon? It might be. <laughs> it might be bacon. What, in a microwave? 
Uh, you know, um, the bacon that we eat most over here, I mean, she does, like, buy real bacon to, like, wrap other meats in, that kind of thing. But um, uh, usually for, like, breakfast and, uh, you know, bacon-type sandwiches, we actually mm. use turkey bacon. Try to get a little lean. Uh, I don't know what I don't know if, if it's actually I don't know how you get bacon out of a turkey, but I know it's supposed to be lean. But um, I don't know. I've always yeah. been confused by turkey bacon. Yeah, weird, isn't it? Especially when you know that bacon's supposed to be from a pig. Yeah. <laughs> I think the best part of bacon when it's uh, nicely cooked as well, when when it's just gone a bit hard and crispy, is the is the fat when it's nice and crispy. It's like crackling from a pork as well. That's lovely. Oh, I see. Uh, so you said you got two, two Twitch accounts. You lost the first one. Access to the first one. How did you lose access to it? Um, was it just a password? So you made another one? Okay. Well, hopefully you understand what I'm trying to say, though. You know what I mean? I uh, that is definitely something. I, I don't. I, I don't know if what I'm saying is just not clear to you. <laughs> but um, that it, it is definitely something that. Uh, whatever the issues is with your access to your other account is something you should definitely be addressing and not me and uh, and not me I, it's just because my ban list I do occasionally will go in there and clean it up you know what I mean and um, I, I don't want to have to maintain that I tell you what maybe I'll just go make another account for myself all right and then I'll start streaming from that one instead no I'm not going to do that either Nah, I'm sorry, uh, Battle Pirate Sharks. Um, yeah, it's definitely whatever that issue is with you. Just to worry about you getting an email, man. You're, you're wanting me to do an awful lot of work, and you're actually making my whole stream about your account now. And I, I don't, I, that's not really cool either. I mean, uh, having an account that's following me, hopefully it really isn't that bad. Hey, nobody else than me? Hey, oh, Dayhawk, how's it going? <laughs> uh, are, you're talking about to where I'm at right now? Uh, nobody else than me? see here <laughs> oh that's Dayhawk though I know Dayhawk I think Day he's collecting cargo yeah he's it? he's just collecting cargo Now, I'm out here in this other sector, so I, I can't guarantee your fleet is safe. I'm just saying. Well, I can't guarantee it no matter what sector we're in, but I'm just saying that I'm somewhere else. Oh, you gone back to that one? Yeah. I don't know what's up with your mic, man, but it seems like it's feeding back a little bit. Again? Yeah, I just heard it just a little bit. But oh. uh, did you ever find out what was the issue with it yesterday? or I mean, did you do anything? No, that's the problem. I haven't done nothing at all. Happy. Weird. Yeah, occasionally I'll just hear hear the feedback, but... What kind of feedback? 
Um, you know, what might be best is if you... Let me see. Actually, did you watch the show back yesterday? Do you ever watch the uh, roundtable shows back? No, I hate my voice. <laughs> Believe it or not. I, I will do. <laughs> Funny, footy, Harry. It's taking so long in there. Oh man, I just assumed everything in here was dead. This guy out here raking this proto. Smell biscuits. You making biscuits? What you making? Tater tots? Fish sticks. Fish sticks. Man, smell all kinds of weird stuff, man. I don't know where the smells are coming from. It's terrible. Is this any better price? Well, so far. I mean, because it was kind of like hit and miss anyway. I've just uh, been into configuration at the top there. Somehow I went to... Uh, default microphone instead of microphone via HD audio that I generally use, which is weird. Oh, okay. Yeah, maybe. Maybe I'll set. Hmm. We'll see. Hey, Foxo. You got all of your fleets repaired and nothing to hit or do? Wow. Do some ranking. Yeah, go out and rank some fleets, man. There's always that. Unless all your boats are legendary. Oh, wow. Hey, take care of Battle Pirate Sharks. Have a good one. Yeah, I'm kind of busy. Yeah, right now, as far as too busy as far as looking for your name and all that stuff. And uh, and like I said, I don't know that you're the same guy, and you might be just trying to get me to ban somebody else for all I know. But um... hey, right, damnation. How are you? I mean that's that's happened. I mean I've I've got I've had imposters and trolls on here before, you know. Yeah, yeah. Afternoon, guys. Whoa, holy moly! Help! <laughs> He's got the screamer. Yeah. Hey, what's going on? Not much, you. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what are you yeah. doing, man? TV in the background. Oh, oh, well, we got to be careful with that on here, man, because uh, that'll get my audio clipped. All right, I'll turn it off. 
Yeah, they'll get my audio clipped. I um, I actually thought that was a child. Oh, I did too, man. I thought he was like <laughs> sitting on a kid or something. <laughs> Strangling. <laughs> yeah, then I'll get my audio clipped, man. Uh, TV and stuff. Uh, Sergeant, I don't know if you know who Sergeant is, but he had that issue for a while where he was like uh, doing videos. Um, but there was like a Disney movie in the background, oh. and and his 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 stuff kept getting clipped. He his, he couldn't understand why all of his stuff was getting like, uh, you know, messed up. You know. That's crazy that they're that anal about stuff. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I suppose in a way it comes down to rights, doesn't it? So yeah, yeah, it's digital rights. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I get it if you're, like, trying to use it to promote your stuff or it's being featured in your stuff, but if it's just on the background, that just seems a little over the top to me. Yeah. Well, there's a lot of pirating going on now nowadays, so they're really cutting down it, aren't they? I went to a customer site one time. He was... Uh, uh, it's a little motel, you know, where he's got like a runners, a monthly runners there. And uh, uh, just going out there trying to investigate like a Wi Fi issue he was having. And uh, man, he was so proud. He was like a wannabe geek, man. And uh, uh, he was so proud of himself, you know. He was, start all, he was using all the Wi Fi terminology, terminology wrong. So it made him a really difficult customer to deal with. Uh -huh. But he was uh, trying so hard to convince me that he was uh, an Uber geek that. He was like just telling me about everything that he was doing that was illegal, you know, uh, on on the internet. <laughs> you know, uh, he running a uh, media server for all of his tenants, that kind of thing. And I'm like, dang, dude. Uh, yeah, you don't want to venture in that. <laughs> yeah, you're not impressing me one bit, man. I mm. not impressing me one bit, man. But it's just so so funny, man. That uh, you get the wannabe geeks out there that are just looking for legitimacy. You know what I mean? Uh, like that's so hard. And he's probably wondering why his Wi-Fi is going slow when he's running some. Yeah, okay. Well, yeah. Well, the issue that he he obviously the issue I had with that particular customer is that he really didn't have any clue uh, about Wi-Fi. Even though he did a whole bunch of research and looking for ter terminology, he was using the wrong words in the wrong places, and he was like constantly rebooting APs and powering them down, thinking that he was doing anything for the signal. But it's like, you know, when you have uh, uh, a, a Wi-Fi system like that where you have um, uh, roaming and all that kind of stuff, yeah. these APs need to be able to talk to each other and settle in on uh, channels, signal strength. They, they, they have all these self-adjustment procedures that they have to go through. Mm -hmm. And if you're not patient, if you give it five minutes and you're convinced that it's wrong and you're sitting there unplugging it again and starting it all over again, That's you're not helping. Work. You're just making right. yourself miserable. You start to go all through that routine again, then it's yeah, yeah. Re repeat repeaters and that. So, ooh. yeah, people people don't know that. You know, it's it's nope. funny. Um, it's not like general Wi-Fi that you go and buy out of Best Buy. You know, nope. it's not the same kind of Wi-Fi. It's a nightmare to set up properly as well. Yeah, but we actually ended up losing the guys because he wasn't listening. And uh, ah. he, he, he wasn't listening, and uh, he was just really convinced that he knew, and he just thought we were full of crap and all that stuff, but, you know, whatever. If he knew, why did he get in touch? Okay. Yeah, yeah, well, he was like, he did have his own Best Buy Wi-Fi stuff going on, where he had APs that he had bought himself and installed, and he's like, I don't have any problems at all with that. And I'm like, I said, you ever think that, that maybe that some of that stuff's what's causing interference and might be messing with your other stuff, you know? I'm, yeah. I mean, it's just... I mean, I don't know if that was really the case, but he was like, uh, he had some illegal software that he was downloading and monitoring Wi-Fi as well. So he was seeing Wi-Fi out of all the, um, the utility vehicles that were driving by and stopping at the light outside the motel. And he was just telling me all kinds of stories, that guy. He was a hoot, man. He was a hoot. <laughs> Um, ranking. You need something? Oh, you're gonna bring my food to me. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. What's up? 
I hope she's made enough for everybody. Yeah. Shame you guys are going to have to watch me eat now. It's nothing special, though. It's, it's, uh, I'm sorry, babe. <laughs> Tater tots and fish sticks, so it's just, uh, oven food, really. It's not fancy deal, dinner like she usually does. I can see a slap coming. <laughs> I'm going to be wearing my dinner. Yeah. <laughs> Hey, uh, congrats, nobody. Thank you, babe. Appreciate it. <sighs> Smells good. set it where you need a smooth surface or whatever son just bring it back if you don't mind when you're done man I might have exhausted this area you've been that a while yeah yeah I'm just going a little further north I'm seeing a couple more up there spark said thank you wife thank you son Ooh. Uh, yeah. She said for what? For making y'all watch me eat? <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm letting the stream continue, yep. Yeah, I got like 20 minutes left on this cruise, so... That smell good. Funny, funny. I'm sure you're doing it on purpose now. <laughs> Sparks. <laughs> You're gonna get in trouble. Just saying. How to have a happy marriage. Wife is always right. <laughs> Lol. Oh, nice one, butter bacon. Nice one. These people up here aren't too upset with me going in here and cleaning out all their cargoes. Why are they following you? No, uh, not at the moment. Oh, uh, she's expensive. That means you can probably get away with a little bit more. Yeah, that's for <laughs> sure.
Hmm. Harry's gone quiet. I like it when Harry goes quiet. He had a reboot. He had. I know oh, he was rebooting. Yeah, he had something going on. And he's been messing around with his computer. I know he had to like uh, take it all the way back down to uh, reinstall our, his operating system, and then he's like updates, running updates, and um, you know, on last Thursday's show when he got to come on, he um, his camera, yeah, his, his camera stopped working like right before the show. That's the trouble when you have to reinstall your all your software and operating system. You was all right though, Price. You did the uh, a clone copy of yours, didn't you? The what? I said when you came to. Uh, Putting your new hard drive and that, and you did a, a clone copy of yours. Yeah, yeah. I kind of feel like, still feel like I need to go back and uh, redo mine, though. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I, I mean, there's just like so many things that just uh, could, I, I think, aren't running ideally. Hmm. You know what I mean? It could be running just a smidge better that I'm having a hard time fixing. It's like my headset, for example. Um, it only works on one USB port. If I, I can't, I can't take it and move it around to another USB port. That's weird. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Um, uh, that's that is weird. Have you got Windows Ten saved? You or mean backed you, up? Uh, you know when you you get a chance of downloading it, don't you? Well, no, I don't really got a. I didn't get a chance to download it. No, it uh, it just updates. You know, it does whatever it does. It updates and then. So that means you're gonna have to reinstall Windows 7 again, or 8. Yeah, my up. yeah my computer came with Windows uh, 8, I believe. But uh, no, there's actually an option in Windows 10 where uh, you can actually set it back to a clean install. Yeah, I tried that and it just seemed to make it worse. Uh, went back to putting Windows 10 back on. I think it's only a month though. You get that option. Yeah, only you know, you get a month to go back to Windows 8. Mm. And I saw that option was still on my screen. I was kind of thinking I was been over a month to go back to Windows 8, and I had to go back to 8 and then uh, back to Windows 10 again. I, I don't know that would that would fix anything. No. It didn't but really sure. seem to fix anything before. But I'm sure you you can get a copy of uh, Windows 10 to burn to a disk. And then you can in install it fresh instead of installing Windows 8. Yeah. See, the trouble is that is like you, me, you're using an SSD drive, so there's you've got things to do differently than installing it onto a normal hard drive. Man, I can imagine how fast these things are going to shoot at Legendary. Way, way fast. Probably be a constant stream, won't it? A lot of fleet mixing these days. A lot of fleet mixing. You remember that was used to be a no-no. Yes. And mixing weapons as well. I remember that. 
Yeah. That was a no no. I think ships have just gotten so powerful that it's okay to mix, you know, mm. just because things have gotten so powerful. Well, I think part of that is ships take so damn long to build that it makes it better to mix them, you know what I mean? It cuts down on build time that you can just put different crap together. Got another message. Yeah, Huskers. <laughs> He's funny. Yeah, getting some cargo hit, man. That's awesome, man. I'm... Good. Hopefully, it might go to another level. Yeah, it'd be awesome. If not, you're going to be very, very close. What's my clock look like? I got four minutes.
nice. Yeah.
Hi, OG Daddy. Hey, G Daddy. Oh, my cruise expired again. <laughs> I think I'm going to drive for a few minutes. I uh, think uh, the sector right here is uh, kind of active at the moment. Um, going ju Judging by the PM I'm getting right now, I guess uh, that uh, War Huskers, he's been on here on my uh, Huskers BP here on my Twitch chat a couple times. Mm -hmm. But uh, he, he spotted me in the sector that I'm in. Uh, what is it, 85? Yeah. Hitting cargo. And uh, was letting me know that I guess there's like another alliance that's supposed to be hitting this one here right now. Uh, yeah, here's another one getting hit. OGR is hitting them. All right. Forces uh, <laughs> at Gore Saber don't care about enforcers at all, does it? No. <clears throat> well, there's only one there, isn't it? Looks like he's got a, a Neptune in there, a Gore Saber, a uh, Rhino, and uh, maybe a Harlock Aegis. He got any damage to his fleet as well. Yeah, barely hurt him at all. Got a minute and 40 seconds left. I guess it didn't feel like. Hmm. He's running a crew too. He's running a uh, demolition Inside. squad. Demolition squad. Yeah. Uh, he'll be sat outside now waiting to move his fleet. It is a good crew, is that? Level 57 fleet, man, that's impressive. That's gonna have a lot of bulk in them. I it's see. You know, 15 million IDs, man. I remember when they were like new, new, you know, but the, you know, I, mm -hmm. I, I, I gotta get used to the fact that, you know, you can be a fairly high level now and have a 15 million ID. Yeah, no, it's unbelievable. I look at how long now we're at, and we're still on 17 mil IDs. We're not attracting any new players, really, are we? Yeah. Nah. I, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, getting them, getting them, and keeping them are two different things. Yeah. I remember the IDs used to fly up. See if I've gone a couple sectors yet.
Gotta find a way for Rila. Now, oh, what you got there, Huskers? I see Huskers. Oh, uh, all right. Let me get that. How did he get uh, 57 coins, Sparko, Sparks? Oh, cool. Yeah, I don't, I don't. I... <laughs> You've got Aegis and a Harlock Aegis in there together. That was interesting. I think the hell starts Island one. Hobbies. That name's familiar. No. Nope. Getting him another one. That's pretty awesome, man. I mean, it, I know me and my proto, man. It, the, the repair time on them things are so bad. Mm. That it makes me... Uh, this is a nice fleet, man. You see this Rhino fleet right here. It's level 49. But he's t taking a lot of damage quick. Mm. Wow. He just got smooshed. You will do. The trouble with them L stars as well on the uh, Proto Nemesis, they take ages to rank as well. All right, drum roll, please. Y'all ready? See what kind of VXP I got on my rhinos. Go on then. Should be somewhat similar to what you got last time. Yeah, three thousand seven hundred fifty-seven. So that one now is up to forty-one percent. Um, yeah, I got one at fifty-one. So one's still at forty-eight, and then I got a forty-five. My frosty's at forty-five, so. That's cool. getting there. Hmm. Yeah, getting there. Getting there. Well, guys, I think I'm going to take a break, man. I've had enough bottle parts for right now. <laughs> I may get back on a little bit. And I, I got uh, on Elite Dangerous. I know I've got my um, my ship is full of garrison supplies, so I need to go out and deliver that. So I may get on there and do that soon, but. Oh, I get it, Sparks. Well, good job getting that resolved, man. It seems like getting anything resolved, getting any kind of... Uh, get. It seems like getting any kind of uh, positive results out of customer support, man, is, is a feat these days, man. It's getting so bad over there. Um, so, yeah, congratulations. Yeah, they're wanting screenshots and videos for everything nowadays. Yeah, yeah. All right, let me do some shout-outs real quick. Uh, okay, Damnation and Hellfire is on here. He's also uh, here on my Hangout. White Star is also here on my Hangout. And, uh, Death Soccer, uh, HH, Dreadmall X, Evo, 6E, G Daddy D, Huskers BP, K Owens, uh, Mike Hugs, Neutral Shock, Sparks, Russ F1502, uh, Sarah Sim 3, uh, The Flying Welshman, and Z Dog 40. Appreciate everybody coming on, the, hanging out in the chat. And uh, keep me cup, keeping me company. But uh, y'all take care. I'm gonna take a break. I'll be back in a little bit. Y'all have a good one. See ya. The price is wrong, bitch. <laughs>